This is no good. This is exploitation. We're out and about tonight as part of the Big Day Out extravaganza for On The Couch. Now I'm joined by a band who are wowing crowds at the Melbourne Big Day Out. And we are here at the Prince of Wales where I'm joined On The Couch by a band that have been described by US Rolling Stone as having a sound that makes Queens of the Stone Age look like Desperate Housewives. We're out and about tonight and I'm joined on the couch by a man who is beyond categorisation. Beneath this uber-friendly exterior lies a deep, dark, brooding individual. We're at our first out and about for season two and I'm joined on the couch with a man who loves roots. <laughs> And when I say roots, I mean music, so get your minds out of the gutters, and it'll be none other than the effervescent Ash Grunwald. So what's what's happening for the rest of the year for you guys? And have you got any big shot producers in helping produce the album? You've recorded uh, a soundtrack to a movie, an animated movie. Want to tell us a little bit about that? Is the dark side of you your alter ego? Because you're very you're a very animated eccentric person normally what's with the dark side i did a miss i just did, did a missy higgins, higgins to it yeah yeah and i did uh melbourne brisbane perth and adelaide that was really good yeah really amazing because they were there are really big crowds there yeah. she's she's pulling big numbers and kicking ass so it's about uh you know around yeah. But they're there for you too, that, yeah? Well, there, you know, I think, Grunwald you know, yeah, I think a lot Missy of them Higgins. came. Ash Grunwald plus Missy. It was a bonus that Missy was on the bill. Yeah. But, yeah. He's done a few big albums, hasn't he? Yeah, he's Nick, did a lot of Nick Cave records yeah, yeah. and yeah. Beth Orton and Athlete and stuff like that. Angst, so, angst right there, there's a lot of whoa. angst right there. It's <laughs> a few funny stories. That is pretty, does he tell you many stories about uh, Nick yeah. Cave? Yeah, and he went, um, he told us about, he went on a date with Carly Minogue once as well, so. That was quite impressive. You're gonna like that. <laughs> he, uh, he was saying he recorded Lee's Scratch Perry in a basement in London years ago, and uh, apparently they had to record in the dark, so he had to use like a pencil light. That Lee Scratch Perry wasn't on the scene. Apparently, four or five days in, he had a meltdown and started. They were in the basement, took a pickaxe to the floorboards because he, he wanted to feel real earth. <laughs> Psycho! It's a record about over 28 clubs. Oh, great. It's a record of what you do when, you know, dream knows over. So it appeals to losers pretty much. Loser men in dark periods of their lives. So wear shirts like this? What was your name again? Yeah, it's Katie. Yeah. You look very nice. Yeah. <laughs> now I think every band before they goes on go on stage needs a little special treat. <laughs> I've been Katie T, I've been on the couch with Wood's mother. Couch. Now we're shooting back to the studio where Steph is with a very special guest. I'm into the energy this year, I'm feeling the vibe. Stick your adjudicating up your ass, you hairy little man. She's got a brother. I need a big drink. Good evening, uh, fellow viewers. It's shtick time. It's shtick time. You guessed it. It's shtick time. It's time for the one, the only, the shtick. This is a national show, and we want everyone to understand how good Aussie music is. Once you hear it, I kid you not, you will not get it out of your head, and you'll be singing and dancing out loud. The album rocks. It's got blues, it's got rock, it's a bit of country in there, and they've morphed it all together. They've made it their own. Sheer bliss. Don't do duets with Russell Crowe. You know how we feel about Russell Crowe. Anyone that can sport a moustache like that is okay in my books. It's a firm doggette, right. but I'd be walking around in like a G-string <laughs> going, yeah, the this. It's very un-Australian to pine. It's sort of a fashion faux pas, so to speak. Kind of got the swagger of Woody Allen, which is kind of a little bit weird because he's not ugly like Woody Allen. They are psycho, but it's good psycho. Beautiful, beautiful. You go, you go, girlfriend. You go, yeah, you go. I'm you feeling go. the music. You go, girlfriend. I'm yeah. She's electric. She's in a family full of eccentrics. She's done things I've never. 
I've been Katie T, rock on you crazy diamonds. Gold, it's gold. <laughs>